New at five, an Umbo High School teacher hot water tonight accused of repeatedly shoving a student. The classroom assault caught on camera. The video you're seeing here, it shows a teacher shoving the student onto a table and then a wall multiple times. KPRC 2's Mario Diaz joining us now live from the newsroom with those details and a response from the district, Mario. Danielle, and to be clear, it's an investigation involving law enforcement. Today, the student's father is speaking out over what he and the district says should have never happened. A teacher shoving a student against a classroom wall multiple times, captured on video. It happened 48 hours ago at Humble High School. The teacher grabbing the 16-year-old student and forcibly pushing him into a wall. The student not retaliating. Over Bolden is the father of the student. I mean, no child should be having his hands, having a teacher who is supposed to be teaching and protecting him, slang him all over the room like he a rag doll. Adding a teacher came in from another classroom to help a substitute teacher. All the students at the end of the day just talking, being loud at the end of the day. That teacher didn't want it going on, so he came over there and he approached my son to tell my son to be quiet. Shortly thereafter, things escalated. Humble ISD says the incident should have never happened and it's unacceptable. District police are investigating. The student's family and others shocked over everything captured on video. I don't want another student to have to feel the way that my baby feels. May you be white, black, Hispanic, Asian, it does not matter to me. There is no question and no doubt that that teacher assaulted that young student and should be charged. Bolden says there is a double standard in his mind, especially if the roles were reversed. If he would have struck that teacher like he should have or what he needed to do in a situation like that after being slung across the room, they would have had him in handcuffs. Humble ISD says this should have never happened and it is unacceptable. District police are investigating, adding the teachers on leave and unlikely to return upon the conclusion of an investigation. Live in the newsroom, Mario Diaz, KPRC2 investigates.